to create the source and drain regions of the transistor. The photoresist is stripped and again the wafers are cleaned. In a furnace, the wafers are annealed and defects created by ion implantation are repaired. Next, a thick insulating glass layer is deposited. The many different layers previously deposited and patterned are completely covered, leaving an unleveled glass surface with varying depths of fields. To ensure every part of subsequent mask patterns are transferred in sharp focus, the surface must be planarized. A chemical mechanical method is used to polish down the thick oxide layer on the wafer surface. This creates the flat level surface required for producing high resolution patterns. Photolithography and mask number six define the openings through which the metal wiring will be able to contact the source, gate, and drain regions of each transistor. By plasma etching the unmasked portions of the silicon dioxide, contact holes are created. Through the microscope, these holes are seen as the small dots. In nose chips, these contact holes are so small, they must first be filled with a metal plug to ensure a solid electrical connection. Tungsten metal is deposited over the surface to completely fill these tiny holes. In a metal etcher, the top tungsten layer is then etched or polished down to the oxide layer. This leaves tungsten plugs in the contact holes, connecting to the polysilicon gate and the source and drain. A layer of an aluminum silicon alloy is deposited onto the wafer to become the first level of circuit wiring. Mask number seven patterns the aluminum. This is the first level in which individual transistors are wired together to form complex blocks of circuitry. The excess aluminum is removed using dry etching and the photoresist is removed. This leaves narrow metal strips which extend from one transistor to another and form the first layer of wires connecting the circuitry. In sophisticated circuits, the wiring is so complex that it is impossible to complete with a single level of aluminum wiring. Several additional